for your something old, you could wear my veil. You know, Georgie's 11 years younger than me. I, I think I am the something old. <laughs> Don't worry. When he loses all his hair, he's gonna look way older than you. Aw, thanks. Hey, would you be upset if we didn't get married by Father Donovan? Did that woman convince you to get married Baptist? She says it's not a cult, but I'm not so sure. No, no, we're just, we're thinking maybe no church. It's just causing fights, and Georgie and I don't really care. Well, what about Cece? Aren't you gonna get her baptized? I don't know, maybe when she's older, if that's what she wants. It's your wedding. Whatever makes you happy makes me happy. Thanks, Mom, that means a lot. Look at that sweater. That would look so good on you. Actually, that is cute. You should go try it on. You think so? Yeah. I'll watch Cece. We'll go do a lap around the park. Really? Here, take my credit card. It's on me. Thanks. Baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Here's a little something for you. I mean, can you believe that? Well, my mom's pretty religious, so that makes sense. And you're just okay with this? Is it that big a deal? They sprinkled some water on Cece's head and asked God to look out for her. Where's the harm? Do I have to explain it to you? No. Could you? They're making decisions about our child without talking to us. That's totally unacceptable. I'm right there with you. Not cool. Okay, so what are we gonna do about it? Well, I'm gonna talk to both of them and make it real clear there'll be no more baptizing. We are done with that. I forget sometimes what a child you are. You know, when you say hurtful stuff like that, you sound a little like your mother. You say that again. I kinda wish I never said it the first time. Mm-hmm. My child was kidnapped twice. I mean, you'd think Georgie would be on my side, but he wasn't even upset. Well, you know, sometimes men can be idiots. Lovable idiots. Look, they cross the line, and there is no defending that. Thank you. You know, sometimes grandparents just think they can do whatever they want. And they can't. That's right. Great-grandparents, on the other hand, well, they get a free pass. Because they got one foot in the grave. Take a break. So, what am I gonna do? I mean, I live with Mary, and I'm stuck with my mother. Well, there have to be consequences. Maybe you could start by cutting off access to Cece for a little while. Yeah, but then I have no babysitters. Well, let's keep thinking. Unless you two are volunteering. Keep thinking. Morning. Morning. What do you want? I brought you some flowers. You didn't have to do that. I had to do something to apologize. For? For not being on your side? boy. Thank you. Y'all got anything going on today? Not much. Well, I had a nap on the docket. How do you feel about coming down to City Hall to witness me and Georgie get married? We're getting married? Shh. What about your parents? Well, you're the one that said there had to be consequences. So, we're really not gonna invite our folks? Is that okay? I guess the only person I need there is you. 